Good morning. Happy Easter. Today we begin to break down Attraction 41 questions. Today is question number three. All of these will be via podcast and video that began on March 29th, 2018 at the YouTube channel Holistic Healing Community by Susie Jervich. Do subscribe to follow this complimentary offering of how to tune into attracting your desired goal, intent, or juicy, groovy vibe. (laughs) So take a moment and settle in and then we'll get started. Ever have a moment when you decide to upgrade your questions? Ever notice that you attract something new by reframing your question? Ever notice how your body feels by attracting something new? What if you decide to ask better questions? Question number three of 41. Do you journal? (laughs) So I'm going to give you three simple tips here. Number one, celebrate what arises. As the magnificent artisan that you are, you may realize that you have been journaling your whole life. Look around. Your journaling of your experiences may be in your writing. Hmm, I'm a writer. (laughs) Your art, your appreciation of beauty, your home, your profession, your relationships, your imagination, your gardening, your children, your grandchildren's faces. Begin to see the journal of your records, also known as the Akashic Records, um, that it's carried in your DNA, in fact, that it's in your very state of being. You are continually journaling, in essence, as your past and life shift, change, and expand. Patterns and lessons are succinctly adjusting to new stimuli, and experiential fields envelop right before your eyes. See journaling now as a dynamic, energetic stream of exploration on the inner and outer realms of potentiality. Number two, miracles abound. When you, precious one, come into experiences, or some say lessons, you may come to know the Miracles Act as a book into completion on one particular learning loop. It is recommended that you, in your own artisan way, express out that a miracle, in fact, was expressed. With this being said, note all levels of miracles. Some may observe what appears to be a minute miracle, when, in fact, the miracle has created an extraordinary new opening in your life. See miracles as an every moment experience. Neutralize your interpretation of the miracle, i.e. something bad happened, and see the miracle of what arises within your whole being. Miracle zone in challenging times may awaken dormant resilience, strength, courage, faith, trust, love, etc. Saturate Saturate in the knowing that your miracle meets you on the other side of your experiential field. Document these miracles as a legacy, a living legacy, of your highest expression of self. Number three, give thanks (laughs) 24-7. Journaling your gratitude is a gift unto a gift. When you give attention to that which has already been gifted to you, you create a more energetic flow momentum. The act of gratitude is a cosmic high-five of thank you and let's create more of the same. When you become intentional with your gratitude practice, you may, notice, you may notice a period of void or space, which then flows right into a period of expansion or heart opening. In the space of the heart opening is the sense of higher understanding and wisdom of the truth of who and what you are. Grateful. Grateful for your life and for all that has encompassed within your field you are here you have a purpose and for that i am grateful with that being said we are complete with do you journal (laughs) tomorrow's question number four is who is your closest friend that you can bounce ideas off of so you have a most beautiful and blessed and juicy, juicy day.